ketones are a very misunderstood molecule. It's not surprising that there are some terms associated with ketones that are also misunderstood. And two terms I wanted to mention, ketosis and ketoacidosis. The difference between the two is significant. It's actually a difference of about 10 times the amount of ketones in the blood. Whereas the average individual who's fasting or engaging in a low carb diet, a non-diabetic, their ketone levels would not go to the level of ketoacidosis. They could only get to ketosis, which is a controlled state where the pH of the body isn't changing. In ketoacidosis, this is a state that can be achieved when insulin has reached zero. Remember, insulin controls fat burning, which means insulin controls ketone production. And no insulin means uncontrolled ketone production. And now it, it's overwhelming the body's ability to keep pH in check. But that is about a 10 times higher level of ketones, unachievable by the average person.